Well, howdy diddly dandy there, chums, as I, Captain Stephen Egg. So in today's episode, chums, I'm going to be making fibrous stew. Heck yes. Now, this is an awesome way to make nanites. So yeah, if you're running short on nanites, yeah, this is the quickest and bestest way, I think, to date. This is freaking mind-blowing. You watch how quick this is. So I'm going to go on over to my planter bays, and we need solarium, and we get solarium from the solar vine. So here we go. Let's pick the solar vine. Then, yep. Yeah. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to pick that one all too easy. No, nope, it's not going in my pocket. We'll grab this one. Yeah, lovely. Now let's try this one in the corner. Right, come on. You know you want to. Come on. In. Oh, for fudge's sake. Yeah, go on. One more try. Jump in like a p cricket possessed. Heck yes. Right, okay. Word to the wise. Don't build in corners. Heck no. It's a pain in the neck. Right, let's head on over to the Neutron Processor Yards. Hello there, Neutron Processor Yards. Right, so here we go. Let's head into here and we need to get the Solari arm. Let's split that down. And I want stacks under 50. So there we go. Chuck that in there. Oh, it's a nice even stack. Lovely. We'll come back to that one in a minute. Right, and let's go into here and let's grab this and let's put that in there as well. Chick boom. All the way down under 50. Lovely jubbly. Although it says that it can take a, a, a yield of 100, it really can't. Yeah, it's sort of bugged out that. I'm, I'm hoping that they fix the nutrient processors in, in due course. Let's put that in there. Lovely. Not an even stack. That one's, that one's an odd stack. But it doesn't overly matter. I might have to do a few runs backwards and forwards on this, but I'm going to show you how quick this is. I'm just going to chuck the whole freaking stack in that last one, though. Lovely. And I might have to split that down, but I can do all that in my own time. Well, let's head on over to the first one that I got going, which was the nice even stack. This one here, let's interact with this one. And we're just going to interrupt this nutrient processor here. So I'm just going to hit stop processing when it gets to an even number. There you go, 18. That'll do. Lovely. I'm just going to hide that away for a second. I'll come back to this in a moment. But yeah, I'm going to split it just by pressing square when I pick it up. And I'm going to put them into two equal stacks. And you can see there, it turns into fibrous stew. No need to mix and muddle about with this one. Just split the stack. And you're making fibrous stew. This is awesome. Look, and I'm, I'm hovering over it at the moment. You look at the units just climbing up there, chums. So if you're early game and you've got a nutrient processor, you've got some hazmat gloves, and you're on a solarium planet with solar vine growing in the wild, you're freaking quids in. Yeah, you could get all this stuff. You can either trade it for nanites or you can trade it for units. This is a lovely way, early game, providing you've got those two things, to make a shed load of freaking units or nanites. Yeah, anyway, I'll see you guys over at the uh, next arse with crony arse. Okay, so here I am with crony arse. Now, in Greek mythology, chums, there's two types of Cronus. There's Cronus, the god of time, then there's Cronus, this guy, who was a glutton. He actually ate his own children. Yeah, lovely chap, this guy. I think he actually castrated them first. Yeah, bizarre, odd, I know. Anyway, I'm just going to go into a first-person perspective so I can do this a lot quicker. And I'm just going to options and general. General, I'm making sure my hold to confirm is disabled because that way I can do this a heck of a lot quicker. Yeah, every second counts. So turning those settings off will really help you out. Okay, hello there, Cronus. Oh, before I actually talk to him and interact and start giving him stuff, I want to see how many nanites I have before I start the process. 147.135. We'll just say 147 to keep it simple. And I have 50, 50, 100, 150, plus 38. So that's one. 88, I think. Yeah, I think that's about right. Cool. Okay, so we're just turning one, and we'll see what he gives us. Here we go. Present fibrous stew. Oh, he's called me an artist. Lovely. And he just gave me 70 nanites. Now, if that's the average, and I've got 186 of these things to hand in, that's that's freaking awesome. But yeah, we're reconvening a bit once I handed them all in. We'll see how many we get in. Tatiya! Well, hello there, Mr. Cronus. Right, I already have three more to turn into this glutton. So you go and take that, you child eater. What do you think of that? Lovely and jubbly. Yum, yum. And another. So yeah, I'm just putting this little round ellipse just in the top corner there. Chicka pow pow, chicka poom poom. Super duper quick because I've got that uh, hold to confirm turned off. Saves me vital seconds and it all adds up over time. Right, let's go back into my first person perspective. Ah! Or third person, I should say. Lovely jubbly. Right, so let's. Moment of truth. Here we go. 159295. Right, well, quick and simple maths. That's 12k freaking nights. And this was super quick, so handing them into Kronos took me roughly about 15 minutes, so not all that long. This is freaking mind-blowing. 12,000 nanites? This has got to be the best cooking method ever! Heck yes. So there you go, fibrous stew, people. Fibrous freaking stew! You guys have been awesome. I've been Captain Steve, and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again!
I want to say a massive great big thank you for watching. If you like what you see, please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. And thank you to my backers over on Patreon and on YouTube membership. If you do want to support this channel, you could just not skip my adverts. That throws revenue down my avenue. Or stay with Captain Steve a little bit longer and hit something on this screen. Heck yes, there's also merch on this screen now. Awesome!